My name is Mark Humphreys with Lincoln Electric Cutting Systems and today we want to teach you how to design and cut out a metal picture frame on your Torchmate CNC plasma cutting table. Start off by opening up Torchmate CAD on your computer and follow along with these steps. Keep in mind that we also have the CDL file and the G-code file located on this thread on fabricationforum.com. Let's get started. Open up the rectangle tool and adjust the dimensions to be 8.5 inches by 6.5 inches. Draw another rectangle adjacent to the frame of the rectangle and adjust the dimensions to be slightly bigger than a typical 5x7 frame. Select both of the rectangles and click C and then E to center them both vertically and horizontally. Go to Arrange Make Path to drop the inner rectangle to make the frame. Bring it to the bottom left quadrant of your sheet and start to make the feet that will help the frame stand on its own. In order to bend the feet, you will want to make them fairly thin. Draw a longer rectangle to support the frame as it leans back. Shift click both of the rectangles to make up the feet and apply a basic weld. Move the foot to where it barely overlaps the base of the frame. Duplicate the foot and match the placement of the frame to be symmetrical with the other foot. Shift click each of the feet and the frame to apply a basic weld. To support the photo in the frame, we are going to make another rectangle that is slightly larger than the inner dimensions of the frame. This plate will be welded onto the back of the frame, leaving an opening at the top to slip the picture in. Select all of the files to create a mail toolpath. Go to Machine, Create Toolpath, and click Mail. Skip the template window and move to the Basic Cut tab. Program a feed rate of 100 at the bottom and ensure that Plasma is your tool. Move on to the next tab to create a lead-in of an eighth of an inch. Press OK to apply the settings. Move the design into the bottom left hand corner of the sheet and go to Machine, Output, and ensure that the tool and device settings in the top left corner of your screen are set to Multi-Tool and Accumove Imperial. Click Cut Now to convert the design to G-Code. Save the file on a flash drive or in the Jobs folder of the computer that is connected to the controller. You're now ready to cut your file.
more tutorials just like this one, visit us at fabricationforum.com. If you're interested in a Torchmate machine of your very own, feel free to give us a call at 775-673-2200.